the just the amount of improvement we can take away from that game. I feel like going against two guys like that, um, going into the game, you, you ultimately freshmen, so you don't really know where you're at. So having a dude to go against who's received the accolades he's received, um, just coming out of that game, um, realizing that you you can you can compete with the best in the country. Um, everyone on that on the defensive side. Um, so there's just it was more so just understanding like what we have to clean up as a defense. Um, and how far we can really go um, in the future. He's a good quarterback. I mean, he's a special quarterback. He can throw the ball like 60 yards like off his back foot. So things like that. He's a special talent. So ultimately, I have to respect that um, as a defense. I mean, when you have a quarterback like that who's confident in himself and his abilities, you have to ultimately be prepared um, for everything. So you, know, you just have to be on your um, on your game when you go against a dude like this. It was a good feeling. Um, I mean, ultimately, that's not like where I want to be at. Um, so it's just. It was a good feeling, um, but also I have to give credit to my teammates. I mean, they pushed me to become the best player I could be. Even my coach, Coach Mickens, also pushed me to become the best player. So I feel like it's just an it's just an overall. Um, although I won the award, I feel like I wouldn't. It wouldn't have happened if it wasn't for them. So I got to give all the glory to them.